It's a chocolate and chestnut semi-fredo. You ever made one of those? No. no. All right, you ready? Like yeah, bring it on. Yeah. All right, why don't you come and help me? <laughs> okay. Basically, Sharon, there's a few components to this. Component number one is little meringue cookies. It's one of Brian's favorites. Yeah, and have one. Do you get them ready Actually, made? Actually, give them two. <laughs> or you make them? No, you can buy them or you can make them, okay? Which is just, again, stiff egg whites with sugar, done like out of a star tip, mm. baked very, very low temperature. Chocolate, good. chopped up. That's this component right oh, here. Okay. So that's component number one. Component number two, you and I, busy people. Chestnuts, I like to roast them. But it's a big But it's a big, deal. it's a, right. So you can buy them. You can buy them already pre-roasted. Are they dried or are they in a no, sauce? They're, or no, they're just dry. Yeah. So they're regular oh, Some okay. come in a syrup, mm -hmm. some come liquid, like this here. This comes in a little brine, like a liquid brine. Does it make Sweet. a difference? No, not at all. But what we want to do is take a little bit of that and puree it. Okay. All right, so here's the step we're going to do, a double boiler. Now, most TV shows, they're going to have a glass thing in here so you can see in it, la, 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 la. Well, you know what? You have the easy way. Yeah. No, no, no. It's like old-fashioned way. Five egg yolks. Sugar. Here's the whisk, you can, start, you can start whisking. What we're doing is we're incorporating the sugar and at the same time, we're looking for ribbons because eventually what we're gonna do is add this chestnut puree oh, in there. Oh, I see, okay. So it's just like if you're making a hollandaise sauce, except we're doing it sweet and we're not gonna add any butter to it, we're gonna add the puree of chestnut. Does it matter if I just sort of whisk it around or I do it more like a fold? Does no, 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 matter? whisk it, whisk it good. Because you good? wanna dissolve that sugar in there and you really want the sugar to dissolve so that it begins to start getting ribbony, okay? Now, here's what we're gonna do. Again, stiff meringue, uh -huh. high peaks, stiff peaks, little sugar in here. Now, I also have whipped cream, okay? Not sweetened yet, okay? Because we're gonna add a little bit of brandy to that. Now, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take this mixture And we're gonna start folding it into this. So that's where you fold. So I'm the, be the beating it up and you are the gently folding you it You wanna in. switch? No, I'm okay. Come on, I'll switch. Take a, you take up my aggression on that. <laughs> I'll whisk, you I'll fold. fold. See, you weren't, you weren't aggressive enough over here. Probably not. See, See? You're, you're roughing it up. Now, <laughs> what we're gonna then do, we start dissolving the sugar. Now we're gonna add the puree of chestnuts in here. So we have that. How's your uh, folding doing? I don't know, am I too dainty? No, you're doing good. Fold no. it though, don't stir it. So All right, so once we get to ribbons, guess what? Then we cool it. And I have it here. Oh, it's Make on Make sure the, ice. the water. Okay. Yeah, look, look at this. Now, Should you're gonna take it? your, yeah, you're gonna take your, and you're gonna fold that. Now, Brian's been baking a bit, and sometimes his cookies... Good man. Yeah, but sometimes his cookies come out a little bit heavy. Density? And, yeah. Maybe he's whipping it or Whip mixing it too much. Okay. Can I use this for a second? Sure. Okay. Since you know what you're doing. Well, you do too. Well, getting there. You may do this in your next party. I might. All right, go so ahead. Good. Keep folding. You're doing great. Folding, folding. Because now, you think it's all incorporated? Pretty much. All right, so here's little... what we're gonna do. One layer in the bottom, we're gonna do yeah, this. There. A nice layer of the meringue and chocolate mixture. Now you go. Do I pour it on top? Not all, about halfway full. Okay. Great. Then smooth it out. Perfect. Then I come with another layer. Yeah. Then you top it off. I sneak it in there. Go ahead. <laughs> And we'll top it off. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna freeze this for eight hours. Oh, okay. 